Guys, 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 guys. Something very weird and not ordinary has taken place on our planet. On planet Miola, on cube Miola. Something weird. There was a crash. There was some fire, some burning, a blaze from the sky. I don't know what it is, but we gotta go in and investigate and make sure all of our dinosaurs are okay. Who knows what it could be? Who knows what it could have fallen from the sky? We gotta find out. We, there's no time to waste. Who knows what might have happened? Hold on just a second. Hold on just a second. This wasn't here when I left it last time. What? What is? Whoa! It's a UFO! <laughs> Oh, we've had a UFO crash land on the planet, guys. A UFO of all things. What is this mysterious object? Where did it come from? Nobody knows. Why does it have patch marks on it? Is it hurt? It must be hurt. The poor little UFO. It must be injured. But wait a second. There is a UFO. Who was piloting the UFO? Might there be aliens on our planet now? Could there be? Hiding amongst our dinosaur world? Some aliens? Who knows? Should we have a little look around? Should we have a little look around? See if there's any unusual beings hiding amongst our little dinosaur creatures through here? Now Stegosaurus, he was here before. He ain't no he ain't no alien. Our little crocodile fellas definitely ain't no alien either. Triceratops. Uh, no, no, they're good. Little micey mice. No, they're fine as well. They're fine as well. All of these creatures were here before, for beforehand. What about our T-Rex here? How about- oh, no, 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 our two T-Rex- hold on just a second. That's no- that's no T-Rex hiding behind the T-Rex! That's a- that's a Boxosaurus Rex! That's a- we've been invaded by Boxosaurus Rexes! Oh, guys, welcome back, guys. Welcome back to Birthdays the Beginning. I am Mr. Miola, and this is my- my world of dinosaurs. I am its god. And we have some new inhabitants of our planet. It literally does nothing. It just stands there. It is a very still alien. The alien doesn't want to do nothing. He just wants to chill out next to his T-Rex friend <laughs> and just be disguised. I don't know if the other dinosaurs have picked up on his undinosaur-like, unorganic-like nature, but hey, that's 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 fine by me. Today, what do we have planned though? I did have planned to be, do a bit of an ice age, but I think we might put that off till next episode. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna put that off to next episode. I want to have a little bit more play with the dinosaurs and the uh, prehistoric creatures before we go full mammal on this world. So let's have a little bit of a look through our library and see what options we have available to us today. You know what we could do? We could just spend this entire episode focusing on this bloodline down here. I know we've said this like every episode for the last 10, but there is some awesome stuff here that I really, really, really want to get. And we haven't had any, any luck doing it. So what do you reckon? Should we do that? Although a lot of this stuff is pretty cold creatures, you know, like 15 degrees, 11 degrees are very, very cold creatures. So I don't know if we should do that yet. Maybe we should just ice age this place up. Maybe, 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 maybe. Should we get this shark maybe? We've been saying this stuff for so long and we haven't had any luck. All right, let's have a look at this thing right here, okay? A cephalopod, a cephalopod that emerged, I've read this like 20 times in episodes, that <laughs> emerged after the extinction of ammonites. So we've got to kill off our ammonites. We can do that. You know what? 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 We're going full cold on this game. I don't care. The Ice Age begins. Let's do this thing. No, I want to go up. I want to go up. Let's go up. Ice Age. We're Ice Aging this game. Not a care to give. Not a care in the world. Rise it all up. Or like, yeah, cold it all up. I don't know what I'm saying. Let's just, let's just make this, let's just turn this into one freezy easy pick. Let's go. Get that all nice and high. We've got a nice little mountain top up the top here now. Let's go and uh, raise a bit of this up as well. Because why not? There we go. We've already dropped to three degrees. You know what? Why not over here as well? Over in this corner. Ah, uh, through here. There we go. There we go. And just drag a bit of a canyon straight across this mountain. Why not? Why not? We're down to 38 degrees. I want to hit 30 degrees. Then we're just going to hit play and we're going to see what happens. It's probably going to be pretty bad. We're going to have a lot of deaths, but hopefully with a lot of deaths, we also have a lot of new blood in our world. That's the plan at least. That's what I'm really, really hoping for. I don't know for certain whether it's going to work or not, but hey, 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 who knows? I just want to... Oh God, that increased it. There we go. Much better. Much or much or better. 
Okay. So 37 degrees. I want to get to 30, though. You know what we could do? We could go and rise, raise some of this stuff down here. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. We probably don't even have to raise it far. I still want a deep sea. Just in case. Just in case, you know, there's some deep sea creatures we want to get. There we go, though. We're down to 34 degrees. Oh, man. The Ice Age. It is happening. It is happening. And I feel terrible about it because we're going to have so many deaths. It's the ripening. The ripening is about to take place in our land, in our world, the world of Miola. And it's a sad time for all, except for whoever might flourish from such an event. We're yet to find out who that might be. But let's keep on rising this. I want to keep it all even, but I keep messing it up and ra raising the wrong parts of our world. Okay, let's go and raise this a little further. I still want a deep sea. Let's go to deep 20. We're at 31 degrees. And I've run out of HP. All right, let's go ahead and zoom out. We're about to witness the very first, I don't know, result of what we've just done. Let's go see what dies, see what is born, and just fingers crossed that we actually get some stuff and not everything just dies and goes extinct and our world just vanishes from eternity. Nothing's happening. Nothing is happening at all. Come on, speed it up. Okay. Oh, wait, we gotta wait. We gotta wait for the temperatures to drop. That does take time. All right, we've got a new plant. Yo! We just had like four new things spot in. Where are they all? We got to... Oh, dude, there is so much new stuff. There is so much new stuff. There's actually something down in this water. Seaweed. More plants. We love plants, don't we, guys? Thumbs up for plants. <laughs> Let me know down below as well what your favorite creature is so far in this game. There's a lot of cool models, and I want you guys to tell me which one looks the coolest. Personally, I'm really liking the blue crocodile. I think the blue crocodile looks really, really awesome. Um, on top of that as well, on top of that as well, our Boxosaurus, of course, looks amazing. <laughs> no, let's keep looking though. What have we got? <gasps> There's little blue frogs up here. I'm glad we got some little creature, and it's not just all plants. It's a Pilosomimimus. Awesome. Now there's something. Oh! We've got the new T-Rex! We've got the new T-Rex! Look at him! What is he? It's a ty- a Tyrannomimimus. A Tyran- a Tyrannomimus. A Tyrannomimus. That is a tongue twister and a half. Try, try to say that five times fast. Tyrannomimus, Tyrannomimus, ty Okay, that's not that hard. It's not that hard. What else do we have? What else do we have around here? We got some little bowls up here. Some little glowing orbs. Let's collect these little fellas. Now there is something down here. Down here. What do we have? Or is it over here? Hold on. Oh, it's a Meganura. It's a Meganura. Meganura, yes. Our favorite, our least favorite guys from Ark. I absolutely hate these guys, but I'm glad we got them in our world because we never had them beforehand. And we've leveled up as well, so sweet. And we also have a one final creature down here and it's seaweed. Love our seaweed. We love our seaweed. And our world is still 40 degrees. So I have no idea how so much stuff just spawned off of so little change. It's 40 degrees. It's not even that cold. So I guess we'll go... Actually, should we zoom out? No, no, no. Let's cool this place down a little bit further. Yeah, let's cool this place down a little bit more. Okay. Oh, <laughs> look how big of an area we can affect now. Our, like, range grew. That's nuts. Okay. All right. All right. Fine. Let's get this done. We can raise it so much faster now. That's awesome. That's awesome. That's exciting. That's exciting. Let me just level it all out all nice and evenly. And then we're going to bump this baby up. Okay, there we go. Okay, and go! 29 degrees. That's a little cold for now. I just want to go to 30. Okay, we're good. Zoom out. And let's try this again. Or, or, no. No, 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 no. Whoa, objects. What do you know? There's our two objects. I haven't seen this many before. Anyways, we've got some new creatures, and I want to have a look at them in here. So our Meganura was the first one. Here he is. Here he is. And from here, we can birth every insect in the game, butterflies and all sorts of things. What do we actually need to do them? 20 to 26 degrees. We're heading for that. Don't you worry. 18 to 24. Hmm. 23, 29. Okay, so there's a lot of cold creatures, except this one actually needs to be quite hot. So we might need to get that one at a later stage. What else did we get? We got our big T-Rex. Where's he at? He's all the way down here. And we still got to get the really, really hot mini T-Rex. Don't have him yet, unfortunately. If you, you might have noticed, though, he was in the thumbnail of last video. 
I did it off camera and I didn't save it. And I've wiped out half our dinosaurs just to unlock that one guy. So we're going to have to find a way to get him without wiping out and extincting every single dinosaur species. I'm not ready for that just yet. How about down here? So it looks like about 20... Man, we're going to have to go to 20 degrees soon. We're going to have to go to 20 degrees. And we're slowly collecting all of the plants as well. There's not a lot of plants left for us to get. But here we go. Let's get out of here. And let's just enter the Ice Age. Let's do it. Let's see what happens. Let's see how many species we kill. We've got a new flower. A bell flower. Awesome. What else can we get, though? A Dipterus. Okay. We're killing a lot of things, though. Okay. Okay. We're going in. I just saw we got a butterfly. Now I'm excited. Butterflies sound cool. Here he is. Here he is. He's up here. Yo! We got a butterfly. He's a, a primal butterfly. What do you know? He, he has a pretty generic name. It's apparently 20 degrees up here. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. What else have we got? There's something chilling over here. It's probably another plant. But I, I hope it's not another plant. Or is it another fish? We've got another fish up here. What's he? A dipterus. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. You know what we should do? I just had an idea of something I want to try, but we'll, we'll try that in a second. After we find all these other creatures that we uh, seem to have somehow spawned into our world. They're all up on the mountain, actually. What else? Is there, there's a plant up here. There's got to be. The bellflower. Yeah, where's the bellflower at? It's like, it should be right in front of me. There it is. It's, it's, it's obviously that one right there. I mean, it's the only thing that looks like it. So we unlocked three new things. We've captured all of them. What I want to do real quick, though is go and sink this down a little bit. Let's drop our river a tad. Oh, it actually doesn't look that great. I wanted to, like, make the water much deeper. No! What did I do? What? Okay. Not ideal. Not ideal. That's not what I had in mind at all. Uh, we have to go create another river source now. Where's our river source at? Right there. Okay. And drop it all. I guess that'll have to do. Why can't I drop it down? That's silly. What? I just did it again. I just want to make a too deep river so we can get some big river creatures, you know. I guess that's not going to happen. All right, let's zoom out of here. Speed things up again and see what we unlock this time. A Velocura. Yo, a Cenephidos. Phenodon. Okay. We're getting unlocks. We're getting so many unlocks right now. It's ridiculous. What else do we have? What else do we have? There's something else up here. Better not be another. Oh, it's fish. We got some fish. They've migrated from the oceans to the rivers. An osteoglossum. Sounds like a possum, but it's not quite a possum. What else have we got up here? Oh, it's another di- It's another di- What's he called again? Sphenodon. Sphenodon. Cool. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Now there's something else up here. It's another, it's another dragonfly. It's another dragonfly or a Meganura. A Velocura. Cool. And another one. Oh my God, we're getting so many insects. We've entered the insect age. I thought we were entering the, the mammal age, not the, in whoa. Oh, he's still up here. I thought it was a new T-Rex. I got excited for a second. Are you, oh no, 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 no. What is this guy? What is this little fella? Hey, little guy. Spenadon. <gasps> and we got something in the sea as well. Tell me it's the guy we've been trying to get for oh so long. It's you, isn't it? That's not the guy we've been trying to get for oh so long, but it's a Progenicolicus or something like that. It's currently 10 degrees over here. 30 degrees over here. So we still got to cool down our seas a little bit. And we still got to kill these guys off, don't we? That's what we got to do. We got to kill this guy off still. What's his name? What's his name? I'm trying to, like, select him. He's called a... It won't let me do it. He's a Ceratite. That's right. That's right. So we still need to make our oceans much, much colder. Hmm. We can do that over time. That's fine. You know what I'm actually going to do, though? We're going to remove our little cold stone here. Because we don't really need it right now. The oceans are... They're cooling down on their own. They've got that... They've got that under control. But let's go into our library real quick. And we're going to see what we have unlocked in our little tree here. We got some more flowers. I wish it showed you which ones were new. That way we could go through one by one. We only got one more of these guys to find out. 
15 to 25 degrees. We'll probably get him soon, you know. A couple little types of seaweed. Another one of these little fellas. And whatever that is. How do I not have that yet? Oh, it has to be really, really hot. Okay, fair enough. So we've got these different types of dragonflies. The Velocura, the Primal Butterfly, and from him we're going to get all sorts of butterflies. There are so many butterflies. It's a bit excessive for the butterflies, I'll tell you that much. 14 to 24 degrees we need in our sea, and we've got to kill these guys off. There's still 230,000 of them though, so it's a bit too many. Um, there's different types of fish. We did get this one here though, I think. Which one did we just unlock? I thought we got that one, but it's definitely not that one. There's a different kind of fish that we unlocked. I don't know which one. I have, Oh, this one right here. That one right there. Okay. Now, what else have we got? We got no new sharks. We got this little guy, though. I think this, is, this guy's new. He just turns into, like, whatever, though. He's an interesting little creature. Was it him or was it something else? Everything's starting to, like, really look the same. <gasps> no, this guy. We got this little fella. He's a little water creature. So there's different types of sea turtles that we can get as well. What do we need to get mammals? We've got the mouse. We've got the mice. We've got so many mice. It's, it's ridiculous. Uh, the monkey's all the way down there. We've got to go below 20 degrees to get these types of mice. Okay. To get... we got 14 to 20 degrees if we want these guys as well. Oh, they look cool. Saber-toothed tigers. Mammoths and, and elephants. Again, below 20 degrees. 24 degrees to get all of these fellas. The bulls and stuff. Okay. To get bears, again, everything is below 20 degrees. So we're going to have to cool down this planet ridiculously to get a lot of that. Are there any more dinosaurs we can get, though, before they all start dying? That's what I'm worried about. I kind of want to throw down a ridiculously hot heat stone. Just to see if it works. To get this guy right here, perhaps. Our little mini T-Rex before, before it all goes wrong. We can get this guy here soon, though. How about a little Arctoteryx, guys? See, these guys are going to spawn when it gets cold. This guy isn't, though. But these guys all are. Okay. How about our ducks? Again, they're all cold, so everything it just needs to be a little bit colder for. But we're going to focus... Actually. Hmm. I was going to say we're going to focus on getting that Ceratite. I think we're going to do that another episode. Let's try and get our little mini T-Rex. We're going to try and try and try again until we get him. 50 to 60 degrees. Okay. Okay, 50 to 60 degrees. I'm going to focus on this area right here. Or oh, a little bit more over here. Problem is, I'm going to have to drop like a heat wave. A massive heat stone to get this job done. 50 to 60 degrees, it said. Which means we're going to go for that. We're going to increase this area by 20 degrees with this heat stone. We're going to go and zoom out of here. Zoom out of here. We're going to zoom out of here. And cross our fingers and hope that this works. Here we go. Nope. We've killed... We killed a bunch of butterflies, but we did unlock something. I don't know what it was. Let's find out. It's in our water. Nope. It's another kind of dragonfly. Today's the insect day, I suppose. Today, it's a marinura. Oh, it's... Okay. Marin... Like a mariner. Like a... Not mariner, but like a... It's like a water... It's a water dragonfly. All right, fine. Let's keep going. What else can we get? Without killing more stuff, please, please. I heard the noise. Yo, we got two new things. Please tell me it's our T-Rex. It might be. There's something here. There's something over here. What is it? <gasps> we did it. We did it. Is this the guy? It's a li Yes. Yes. <laughs> I didn't think we were going to do it. We did it. We've got the mini T-Rex. The smaller Tyrannosaurus. That appears in scorching hot savannas. That's all it took. We had to drop the temperature and then re-raise it. That was easy. And a level up as well. Level 18 now. There's still one more creature over here, though. It could be a plant. It's chilling next to our big T-Rex. What is it? Oh, it's a monkey. Is it a new type of monkey? A, a dry opithecus. Okay. I wanna, I wanna see where this guy fits in in our library. We've got, we've got all the T-Rexes. We've completed the full T-Rex family by chance. I can't believe we did that. We don't have many dinosaurs left to collect. We've got another plesio. Got to be cold to get him though. We've got another, ooh, another trike. Maybe we can try and get the trike because he still needs to be hot to get him. 34 to 45 degrees. I'm gonna try and get him, and then we can get all these birds. But it's gonna be cold for all of these guys. So, okay. 34 to 45 degrees. Oh, and the monkey. There he is. 
I don't even know how we got him. But we're getting pretty darn close to getting people. Oh, God. We're getting really close to getting people. Okay, let's get the track. We're going to focus on the track, though. 35 to 45 degrees above land. Okay. So, all the way out here. Let's collect these little sparkly bits. Uh, 34 to 45 degrees. I have to see. Oh, this is high land. He needs to be an upland. Okay. So, over here somewhere. Hmm. I'm going to increase the temperatures. 35... I've forgotten already what it said. 35 to 45 degrees. Okay. So we're going to have to increase this by 20 degrees. All right. I'm going to place a heat stone up here now. Hopefully it doesn't affect too much. It could get pretty bad. I know. And you know what? This is bugging me. This is bugging me over here. We're going to drop another river source. No, we don't. We need to go and raise that and then drop the river source. It won't let me do it. Oh, that's... Okay. Hold up. Hold up. We've got to go drop that. Raise that, and then drop the river source. Okay, we're good now. We're good. Okay, so now that that's taken care of, the heat stone is up here, right? Is the heat stone? No, it's not. We didn't actually place it. Okay, we're going to drop another heat stone. I'm going to tuck it right up in this corner. It's probably going to kill this monkey, which is going to be unfortunate, but what do you do? This affects such a large area, so this... Could do a lot. This, I don't know what this is going to achieve. Oh, wait. This is still Highlands. It has to be an Upland. So it has to be like over here somewhere. You know what? I'm going to place it right here. New plan. We're throwing it down here. Because the moisture's there that we need. And now the temperature is there. So it's 44 degrees, 63% moisture. And we need 45. Under 45. And 64% moisture. So it is like perfect. It is perfect here. It is perfect conditions. Let's zoom out and see if we can get the final track that we need. That was an elder butterfly. It wasn't what we need. What do we need? An, an alligator. An alligator. Yo, we got a new type of alligator. Or crocodile, whatever you want to call it. Where's he at? <laughs> that I need to stop for. A new type of alligator. It almost looked weird to see a proper, a proper name. Is it this guy? Is it this one? I, yes, it is. Look at the size of him. He's enormous. An alligator. Cool. Cool. Adapted to cool temperatures. It waits patiently for prey, such as Phanodon, to approach the river. Is it bigger than the other one? Yeah, it is. That is enormous. That's huge. And there's something more down here. The grand, the elder butterfly. Where's the elder butterfly? Is he flying or is he on the floor? Oh, it's these guys. It's these little guys. These tiny little guys. How are these guys the elder butterflies? I ain't complaining. I ain't complaining. We got some more sparkly bits though. Let's quickly go dip down and pick up these little guys. Okay. 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 I guess we'll uh, zoom back out. Zoom back out. And see what happens. Let's try again. No. No. Come on. Everything's dying. I don't want everything to die. Just give me the track. Nope, 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 nope. All right, we're not getting it. We're just killing everything. We're killing everything right now. What is wrong with our conditions up here, though? It's supposed to be all good. It's supposed to be all good. It's 40s in the 40s. High 30s, 40s. That's good. The humidity is a bit variant, though. It's a little bit variant. Let me just double check what we actually need. 10 to 64. We're well within that range. A triterosaurus that is apt to live in hot climates with elevation. We should be fine with that. Maybe it's too humid. You know what I'm going to do? That. That's what I'm going to do. All right. Yeah. Let's zoom out. Maybe he's got a little bit more room to spawn now. Who knows? Let's have a look. We got something. Oh! <gasps> I think I know what that is. Let me just keep going though. We've got two new things. And I think one of them may be. It's up here. What is it? What did we get? What did we get? Oh, okay, it's a new type of monkey. I thought we had people for a second. I, I got so scared. A Sahelamanthropopus. Awesome. 
And it's not our T-Rex that we're trying. It's not our tri trike that we're trying to get. Damn. I thought we were going to get it then. I thought that was it. Got some more sparkly bits to collect. Let's get all the sparkly bits. There's one down here in the water. I don't know. I don't even know what. <laughs> I know there are items now. They're probably so pointless to collect, but it just bugs me that they're there and I got to collect them. I got to collect them. You know what I wish? I wish you could get this lava to show up in the world. That would be cool. Imagine that. That'd be like prehistoric, right? All right, let's get out of here. And we're going to give this one last roll of the dice. Come on. Nope. We got two new butterflies. No. We just spawned so many new things in. Let's have a look at what they are. There is so much new stuff. It's butterflies everywhere, man. Butterfly city now. Are you new? I don't know. Nope. This guy must be new. Nope. Nope. A plant? Nope. Who's new here? There's something right here that I'm bl uh, like blind to. Oh, it's a plant. Of course it is. What did I expect it to be? What did I expect it to be? Okay. Okay. And what do we have up here? I thought it was a bat. Could you imagine if we got a bat? That would be nuts. It's a proto butterfly. And, and these little guys, more dragonflies. Can I, can I, can I capture them? There we go. What do we got here? It's a parthenope. Cool, 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 cool. And another thing up here as well. It's another butterfly. This one here is called a marsh butterfly. And then down here, oh, up here, sorry. What do we have? It's not my trikey friend. It's not our trikey friend. I think it's another plant. Or, <laughs> or maybe it's a type of wolf. It's a Canis Dirus. Nice, nice, a nice, 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 nice. Well, guys, unfortunately, we are not going to get our new trike this episode. We're going to spend a little bit of time next episode trying to get it. And if we don't get it, we go on full blown ice age. I don't care. We are icing this place up. We are going to start spawning in mammals and everything. It's going to be nuts. If you guys did enjoy this video, though, please go ahead, punch the thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs ups, and I'll catch you in the next video very, very soon. Bye for now.